Hi everyone, thanks for clicking on my channel. Welcome to the journey home. My name is Catherine and I live in Northern Canada. Here is a daily reading that I give every other day. <laughs> and it's for the general collective. It may not resonate with all of you, but hopefully most of you can take something out of it. Uh, the Zodiacs weren't out this week because I was testing Vimeo. I don't like Vimeo, so I'm not using it. Uh, but I'm working on the Zodiacs now. I'm doing an extra, extra, extra bonus for you guys. I think I like doing the Zodiacs even better than the daily after afternoon delights. But um, to make up for it, I'm, you get two readings coming up this week and very extensive. It was a lot of fun to go into. Anyway, let's get on with your reading, guys. You know which half is you and which half is your significant other. This could be you. This could be them. This could be them. This could be you. Split down the middle. On your side, you have the seven of water, which is confusion. It's the same as the seven of cups. But not, because each dick, deck has <laughs> their own specific art that speaks. Later you'll see that. A card I, I always read the same way, do not read the same way in this spread. Uh, but you have options, and there's some confusion surrounding it as to what to do. And uh, your significant other is holding on for dear life. Almost like uh, they'll try any trick in the book to keep you. On your side is love. You're exhausted from the fight. And you're, you've are you tamed the beast within. And now that beast protects you. Like it sleeps with you. Don't wake the giant kind of thing. you have protection of the universe and i'll tell you why do you see the pillars there's actually six on each side lined up behind each other 12 signs of the zodiac 12 thrones in the kingdom 12 apostles 12 12 you see 12 all over the place That's how you're feeling, exhausted, not defeated, just tired. On this side, your significant other is building momentum. So I guess you're having to rest for whatever's coming. You feel it, you intuitive, intuitively you feel it because you have the spirits, the guides around you and the protection of the lion. They're building momentum. Their intention is to get out of this mess called the past. And they're being guided too by a spirit. Their spirit may not be as regal as the lion, but it's fierce and protective on your side the page of air is the, the same as the page of swords a new beginning in truth and what a freedom that is what a freedom that is. See the feather in the air? On their side, there's a gaggle of people who didn't get the memo on the choreography of the dance. So they're a bit of a nuisance because 
the significant other is marching to the beat of their own drum. They're in harmony with what they want. This may be, you know, opinions and advices that um, are not necessarily welcome or they're just standing their ground. Tree of Earth. So even though you have all these options up here, we were praying for one. Three of Earth is working together at a foundation. Three stones can be laid on one, one decision. And all that's missing is the fourth. But this jumps you to three foundation stones. It could be in a, this could be in more than one area, could be in work too. On their side, they're praying too. Or when they close their eyes, they see you. And when you look in the mirror, you are trying to see a queen. This is about self-esteem. And if, if you're lacking in any of this self-esteem, you're the little seahorse there who wants to see himself or herself uh, decked out in beauty, jewels, you know, monarchy, a crown. That's a magnificent crown. This is what you're working on. What they're thinking of is you. This is also a psychic connection card, guys. So you're, you two are psychically connecting. Now, in other readings, I always said, doesn't this guy look like the evil guy in the Game of Thrones? And he's wearing a mask to boot, so it's, you know, like, what are you hiding? But I think this also means, I don't think, I know, they've been hiding their feelings. They've been holding back. You know, for some of you, maybe they were just even afraid to say, I love you. But look, there's a feather being sent out. That psychic connection. What you see is a mask, but if you look in my eyes, you will find my soul. Wow. I hope this reading resonates for like all of you. That would be an ultimate. But I know it won't. But I can most certainly hope and expect that this resonates for most of you. Most of you. If you can't see this beauty in your life, then it could be that you're just hanging on to too much negativity and wanting to blame everyone else. Channel collector. Oh, thank you guys, by the way, for all those beautiful comments. And uh, hit the like or dislike i like likes more but it really does help me and if you haven't subscribed please subscribe and hit the bell for notification and comment let me know how it resonates let me get to know you better 
I'm still offering $25 readings. Uh, ask as many questions as you like. I'll answer as many as I can in a 15 to 20 minute time span. That's not too loud in your ear shuffling. I never realized how close I was to that microphone with the cards. Here we go, guys. It's time. A four of Wands clarifying the Seven of Water. So, you see? Why did I tell you? See? Why did I tell you? Even though you have all these options and there's some confusion as to what to do, you are praying for one. And exhausted and this is the clarification for this you may have a lot of options but you know there's only one that is going to be you want the right one you want the right one and deep in your heart you're as much in love with this person as they are with you even if there has been inequality in the past. We all can be really stupid sometimes. So they're hanging on, clarified by the Page of Swords. They're not just hanging on. If anybody tries to take it, they'll swipe at them. Nobody's taken what they feel is theirs. And I don't get a malicious feeling about that. I get a one that I get the feeling of never being there before, not having the maturity to know how to handle the, you know, the dynamics of relationships, of love, of twin flames, of soulmates. Do you hear Chloe in the background? She's so rude. You're rude, Chloe. Five of Cups. Yeah. Five of Cups. You're looking at those empty cups. Oh, not in this deck, you're not. You're comparing them. You see the two cups that are left. And it looks like you're going to go for it, but you need to, you know, take a nap and pray is how you feel. It's been a heck of a journey. Eight of fire building momentum towards you. We have the victory card. You saw me shuffle these, right? Page of Air, which is the same as the Ace of Swords, just a step up. Clarified by the Seven Swords. So you've taken what you've got left of your heart and walked away. This could be a sneaking away card. Well, do what you have to do to get safety. To me, that's a healing card. A page of swords, page of air. Like she's got her wings flapping at just the right. I don't know what you would call it. To direct that feather. Harmlessly. For their gaggle, they have a fulfillment of wishes, which means they'll come around. This person made a decision. They don't know how to dance yet. 
they'll come around and they will not only accept you but welcome you as celebratory you'll be celebrated they want to celebrate you messenger of water the self-esteem card clarified by the page of cups so this is like little brother you're you're practicing your psychic abilities your intuition working on yourself building your your you know getting refueled spiritually because of this psychic ability you have you have a fish in your cup and connecting to that psychic ability intuition that way figuring out how, how you can change the world this little cup with a fish in it caused a tidal wave that's how you change the world water is very healing i'd want you for a buddy okay defensive energy this is the same as this well almost very close where they're gaining momentum to get get out of get rid of the past to come out of it not just them but both of you clarified by this you see the sun coming up you see those wands that are all in full bloom they'll fight for it so this person wearing a mask is the king of swords and you don't mess with him he will fight for what he loves and he loves you Tree of Earth being clarified by the Four of Pentacles. So, working together, you're not putting out as much as you did before. In a sense, you're putting out more, but in a different way. You have boundaries now. not ones that you have to fight over perhaps you did it took a while or perhaps they're just being enforced here you're working with them but insisting i, I guess that boundaries not be crossed this is where my safe zone kind of message Talk to the hand. Their queen of water is being clarified by the ten of wands. They want to lay down the burdens. They want to lay down the burdens. They're, they're just done. They want this. And they know to have this. they got to get rid of this. Wow. Well, pull up a romance card, guys. hardly need to look at all of this devotion look at all this devotion we have a new moon coming up pretty soon a couple days three days maybe when is it february 4th 5th engagement oh come on now you saw the cards fall out healing family issues right right healing family issues take it however it resonates guys one more angel therapy And back to what I was saying about the zodiacs. 
wrong. Or maybe I didn't say it. You guys are going to, you're going to, you're all, all going to get like two in the next week because of this trial run I did with Vimeo. I just was totally didn't like it. So I'm not doing it. So the Zodiacs didn't go out for the weekend, which I was really disappointed with. So you are all getting two this week. Uh, extensive two. You are a powerful light worker. It is safe for you to be powerful. Your spiritual power brings great blessings in loving service to the divine. Books. Your life purpose involves writing, reading, editing, or selling spiritually based books. Wonder who that's for, eh? You are profoundly clairvoyant. Trust what you see in your mind's eye as well as with your physical sight. For your spiritual vis vision helps you with healing, teaching, and guidance. Well, thanks for joining me, guys. Have a wonderful day. See you soon.